In this video we will learn how to connect two transistors in parallel. Here we see a simple circuit with a transistor controlling an electric motor. The motor draws a current I that flows through the transistor and back to the battery. The base resistor R controls the current that flows through the transistor. It may happen that the motor draws more current than the maximum current the transistor can handle. In this case we have two options. We can buy a more powerful transistor or we can connect two transistors in parallel to double the power of a single one. Every transistor needs a base resistor that controls the current that flows from collector to the emitter. In order to connect two transistors in parallel, they must be of the same model and have the same base resistor. First, we will connect together the two base resistors and the two collectors. Now we have to add a small resistor at each of the emitters and then connect them together. With the two transistors in parallel, the previous circuit now looks like this. The two resistors at the emitters must be of a low value, less than 1 ohm. As an example, consider that the resistors are half an ohm each and let's calculate their power rating. If the motor draws a current I, then at each transistor we will have a current I over 2. The power required for the resistors will be I over 2 squared times R. If the motor current is, for example, 6 amps, then the power of the resistor will be 4.5 watts, and you will use the next commercial value that is a resistor of 5 watts. It is also convenient to mount the two transistors in the same heat sink. This will help equalize the current among the two transistors.